I am joined by members of the Texas legislature, and we're here to explain to America that we are dealing with the biggest border crisis since America had borders. It's all because Joe Biden allowed this entire area to be penetrated by the drug cartels that smuggled in illegal immigrants. If you see an area that is off by a container that has razor wire on the container or on the ground or on the fence, those are areas that illegal immigrants were once able to cross that are now unable to cross. And the reason why we've been able to achieve that level of decrease in illegal crossings is only because of great teamwork in agencies across the state of Texas. First, an update about some numbers from the Texas Department of Public Safety. They have made over 39,000 criminal arrests. They have uh, uh, apprehended more than 480,000 illegal migrants. They have deterred more than 95,000 illegal entries and engaged in more than 4,300 bailouts. They have filed more than 19,000 charges for smuggling. Those charges for smuggling now face a new consequence because of members of the legislature who stand behind me. They passed a bill that I signed into law that increases the mandatory minimum time behind bars for smugglers to 10 years. If you smuggle somebody into or through and across the state of Texas illegally, you'll be spending a long time behind bars. We've also had unprecedented su success by the Texas National Guard. Uh, they have more than a million encounters with illegal immigrants. Uh, they have turned back more than 90,000 people who were trying to get into the country illegally. Most of the migrants were coming through Texas. That's not true. The same is true for this area that we gather in right now. If you look at this uh, massive park area, this is an area where you would regularly see 2,000, 3,000, maybe 4,000 people crossing the border illegally. Since this park has been taken over by the National Guard, the daily average is under 10 a day. It shows that deterrence can achieve results at decreasing illegal immigration.